Hey everybody, welcome back to Hackerdoodle's channel and today I am doing a Dollar Tree haul. I'm in a different room today because um, normally I like to videotape in my bathroom because I like the curtain and everything, but it's really bright there. There's a light going through right now and it's pretty early this morning, so I've just decided to do it in here. I'm sorry, you can't really see anything cool to look at, but this is all I'm going to be showing you today. And I have a lot of things I really want to show you because there's just so much. I really want to put things away when I really show you all the new washi tapes that I've been getting. I know I've gotten, um, shown already my uh, Halloween washi tape, but I did get the Christmas ones and I got a really new set that I'm excited to show you. But of course, I'm going to show you that towards the end. So anyway, let's go ahead and start. Um, there's some a couple of boring things I'll start off first, like some of the food items, which isn't very much at all because I only really got one thing. But um, before that, let's, let me just show you. I got these cute um, non-slip swivel head hangers. Okay, so I buy hangers all the time, but I've never really buy these kind, but the only reason why I got them is because the colors really intrigue me. You know me and colors with storage, anything. Anything with the Dollar Tree Essentials brand of anything, they always come with their different colors. I buy them. So I just picked these up. I thought they might be useful. So with our clothing. So I've got these. I got the blue, the pinkish fuchsia, the orange, and the green one. So I thought those are cool. And I'm gonna go ahead and use this in my closet. Okay. Um, Food items I purchased is just some Velveeta cheese sauce. I believe Tanya from the Fuga Cafe had shown these before. I just wanted to go ahead and grab some of this stuff. And I apologize, my hands are all funky. I am using my new 99 cent only store bandages that I got from IBVAL55 and it's a deal. So thank you so much for those. I love them. I just wanted to go and show you those because they're so adorable, cute. Okay, so I got the cheese sauce. I'd like to try those one day. I also picked up these sponges that Animobile has um, called, and I found them finally because I really, really wanted them. They're the Ocello scrub sponges, and they're only a doll. There's only like one in the package, but it's it says it's no scratch, and I thought these were so cute. I always wash my baby bottles um, by hand with, with gloves, of course, and so I was trying to find something to get some of that residue off, especially with my uh, my milk because it's like kind of oily in the bottle and I think I would clean them. So I just go and got some of that one. I got the pink one. So it's pink and it has like these little forks and stuff. These are like really cute. And I believe these are at Target. I think that's what she said. These are at Target kind of, you see these all the time. So I got that. And baby's over there again and on his little swing, his trusty swing. So I got that. And since I'm talking about the baby, let me go ahead and show you some of the stuff I purchased for my baby. I got him some more socks. I'm so crazy about socks and you will be seeing more socks in another haul because I'm just so crazy about them. And I think right now I'm gonna stop buying socks. <laughs> He's in there. And I got um, I got these really cute ones. I guess we have a new set. This one's with the camouflage. I really like that. And then the um, airplanes. So these are so cute. And again, these are for, this is for 18 to 24 months. So this is for like later on. So it's kind of good I'm getting these a little bit later. I also got this. This is for 12 to 18 months. And the other one was like smaller, uh, bigger. And these are cute. They have the little like eyeglasses in them. So I thought these were adorable. I love these type of things. So I put them out. I also found this snack ball that slides open. For easy access to snacks. The first year's brand. And this is for six months. This is for later on for him. I just found this. It's BPA free. And they also came in pink. So I got one of those for him. And in the same brand, I also picked up some of these um, uh, from the first year's these Flexware bendable um, spoons. I know that Pretty and Flawed had all these and she's gotten these before. So I just picked up one in blue and I picked it up in pink and purple. I'm going to give this to one of my, um, I just want to have it in my house whenever my um, goddaughter comes. She's uh, eight months, so she'll probably be using these. So whenever if they ever need a spoon, they would have these available. So I got these too. And also for my goddaughter, I picked up these uh, munchkin headband things. I thought these were so cute. And I got the ones with the little clips. The little, oops, that way. With the rose in the middle. I thought that was cute. And some bows. These are a branding thing, so that's why I wanted to get her some of those. Didn't realize this one's kind of funky. Oh, well, it's kind of offset. Yeah. Hmm. Then on my way out, when I was walking out, I found these Huggies Snug and Dry. I, I keep seeing these. I see them in the 99 cent store, but they're always too big. And these are still a little too big, but I got the small ones. It's like a pack of three for 16 to 8, 28 pounds. And there's a pack of three of these. I just thought these were pretty good to uh, keep in hand in my um, car, just to have them, just in case I never have enough. 
Um, he's too small for this still. I, right now he's a size two. So I just got him the smallest one they have. So it's just good to have these whenever we need these. So I got him that. Oh, and I also picked up another pair of, another set of flatware BPA free 12 pack of forks, spoons, and knives for him. There's four of each kind. So a blue spoon, a green fork, and a yellow knife. Oh yeah. So I got him those. I also have uh, bought him some more safety swabs. I've been using these religiously on his ears just to get the little um, waxy stuff he has. Sometimes I see it and I'm like, you know, I always like to keep my ears clean. So I wanted to make sure I get more of these and I'm already running out of these. So I might just have to buy more and just keep it on hand. So I just want to let you know, I actually use these and these are actually really good to use. But I always stay like around the edges and of course not inside his ear. I found him four books. And this is like the only books I bought him. Is the God Made Earth book. I thought these were really, really, really cute. So there's also, also hardwired pages on them. And the reason why I thought about this is he's getting uh, pap baptized um, next month. And so I thought, oh, because of that, I wanted to get him a couple of like, so somewhat like religious, but saying God made earth. So a couple things just remind me of getting that for him. And then I got him God made colors. So these are so cute. Look at all the little pretty colorful things that they did. So I like that. God made seasons. So oh, so cute. I don't know how they do the colors on that one. And the last one is God Made Animals. I think this is my favorite out of the book because look at all the little cute little pictures that they have in here. So yes, like I said, Dollar Tree or the Green Briar Brand always has them in four. So I always try to collect them all at once. If I don't ever see them at all together, I just don't buy them because I was like, you know, I'm going to have to start hunting for all of them all the time when I do that. So I just rather not get them unless I have all four. So that's it for the kids stuff. I found these cool um, glass case, glass stuff. I found this uh, cute, and I believe it came in silver and stuff, but I got these cute um, uh, eyeglass cases. I don't know if I'm gonna keep this for myself. But I like the color on them. I know my lighting is a little off here. It's really yellow in here. But this is like a bronzy color. I don't know if you can notice that. I know it's really yellow in this room, but um, it's a bronzy brown, very light color. I thought that was really, really pretty. And then I, I went and got this jumbo eyeglass cleaning cloth because my mom, I'm always asking for her to find some because I wear glasses and so does she and she never has any. So I'm going to give this to her. And on my way out, I found this really, really cute case. I put it on Instagram and I'll go ahead and I'll show it right here. But I picked up this one. It's one of those like regular cases that you could also use to clean your glasses. And I really like the print on this one. So I picked up that one. There was probably like four different kinds, I believe. Yeah, there was one that was in a kind of a different color I don't know if it was gray or blue in the same print and then they have one that was just gray and it had like a drawing of how like kind of a squiggle of, of a pair of glasses it was just one and then something another one with a blue background so I picked up this one I like to leave this in my car I'm always looking for something to clean my glasses with so um, that's why I got these so I got that one I also got some bobby pins because I needed some bobby pins I'm always trying to find them I always find them in like bronze color I never find the black ones so when I found this I took those um, okay. uh, I also picked this up for my husband. He doesn't really shave so much, but everybody keeps talking about how good these are. And I see them, and then I don't see them, and then I, when I finally saw them, I said, I'll just go ahead and pick them up for him. He'll probably say, why did you buy this for me? But everybody keeps talking about how good these are, so I'm going to see if he likes them. They probably smell really good and probably work really well. People talk about how expensive they are when they um, find them on Amazon. So I just went and have these. It's always good to have on hand. Um, these expire February 2nd, 2018, so on that one. And then it doesn't say on this one when it expires, so I'm assuming probably around the same time. So yeah, this one expires and just probably doesn't show up, but I'll just say it's around the same time. So I have these uh, Sassini Chic nails that are with the polka dots on them. I thought those are cute. So I got those. I just picked up more of these nail stickers. These are really cute too. I know I've used these too. I found these. I thought this was pretty. Like a cheetah print with different colors. This was new too. They're kind of like, these are like daisies. Daisy color, like these. And then I, did, I, I thought I had these, but I guess I didn't. So these are just the ones with the different shapes. You know me, I wear all the colors. And that's all the ones for the nail stickers. I also picked up this um, SpongeBob towel. I'm gonna give this as a friend mail to somebody. A magic towel. 
Let's do a little bit of the stationery goodies. Cause I do want to show you all the holiday stuff. So, okay, let's go ahead and show these. I found these um, twistable high gel highlighters. I don't know if anybody's ever hauled these before, but I thought these were kind of cool. I just want to get these. So this is a pack of two and it's the blue and the yellow. Twistable, smooth writing, will not dry out bright colors. And I also picked it up in the pink and blue. So I guess it came, I didn't realize they were the same two blue highlighters. So let me know what you guys think of these. I picked up this uh, journal. I know I showed the other one with the foxes and it says best friends. I picked up this one. So this is really, really cute. And I was picking this up for friend mail. Um, I found the owl craft notebook with the little garter on the top and then the bike. So I'm gonna be sending that out soon. I also picked up some stickers. These are kind of old, they're not new. I didn't find any new stickers, but when I saw these, I needed to get them because I use these all the time when I make um, um, cards for people. I like to give out cards and stuff and I don't have any more of these and I really like the big stickers. So I got the owls and I got two of these. I use these all the time for people's cards and their thumbnails. And I also picked up more of the butterflies. I really like them. These are the oversized ones. So I got those. Actually, this one's new. I never picked this one up before. And these are, it's huge, but it'll be cute for like a card. So I got the one with the, um, the rainbow and the peace signs and stuff and the bird. That's cute. I've been doing, I'm going to be starting some pen paling. I have a pen pal I'm meaning to write to her and I'm so sorry I am lagging on it. I'm usually more on the computer writing because of my hands and stuff. I do have carpal tunnel still. So um, you'll see my pen pal is going to be ball. It's going to be typed. So, and I didn't realize I have two of these, but I got some of the computer paper. I thought this is pretty. I have two of these. I don't know why I bought two. So I'm going to give away two of those. And it comes in a pack of 40. I've used these before. They're not the best quality. They're very thin. But, and I'm very picky with my paper, but I just thought because the designs are cute and I could write stuff on it, I thought it's pretty. I got the ones with the duckies on it. It's cute. I found the one with the little uh, daisy flowers with the orange line in the middle. Um, I got the blue. I got this one with the pretty colors on it. So it's really nice. I also got this with the little pink birds and purple. I thought this was really, really pretty. They have a lot of girly ones, so I did take a lot of the girly kind ones. I think there's other designs, but of course I like using other ones. And then I got the one with the dots on it. So this is really good to have on hand. Another set of stickers I found. I found these. I'm not sure if anybody's ever hauled these, but I thought these were so cute. It says Create a Town Sticker Scenes. And I thought these were so, so cute. There are... There's one scene and two sets of stickers. I'm not sure how many stickers you have in each packet, but it has them. They're really small. And I thought I could actually use this to make a card. I'm gonna go try these out. I just thought this, this, the little dogs are really, really cute and cats. So um, at the dog part, I thought I would cut it out and see if I could make it into a cute little card scene. And I also picked up the one with the um, farm. You remind me of those stickers with the farms. It looks like the same set of style of stickers with the pig and stuff, but just larger. So mainly I got it for like the animals and stuff if it doesn't work out. And there's also two in this set too. So I thought that was really cute. I believe there's some other designs. I think there's like a princess one or something like that, but I didn't get any of those. Okay, let's just look at the Halloween items. I didn't get a lot of things because you know me, I'm not, I told you I'm not into the Halloween stuff, but I do have been posting a lot of pictures on Instagram. If you, if you follow me there, sometimes I put it on my Facebook. So if you follow me there, you'll see a lot of things I've been posting, all different stores um, that shows a lot of the Halloween stuff. Um, so I don't, haven't been buying any of those things other than just the bobbleheads I've been showing you in the past. So I've been looking for this, I found some stationery and I didn't want to buy it, but I buckled down and just got them anyway. I got these sticker sheets and there's a five count of these. I thought these were so cute. They're really large. They're the size of, um, they're not like the normal ones that you get. They're kind of small. They're like the size of um, the paper, like an eight and a half by 11. So these will be useful if you want to make certain stuff like decorate your cards or whatever. And also got this background. So that'll be kind of cute to use. Not sure exactly how I'm going to use it just yet. So I'll figure something with this one. I also picked up, let me show you the rest of these. Oh, I've also bought a bale, a straw bale of hay. I was gonna put them for my bobbleheads because I thought, um, who is this? Jody, Jody Saldino, Saladino. I'm sorry if I'm saying your wrong, your name wrong, but she she 
uses this for her decorations for her little her um little bobbleheads and stuff. I thought that's really cute. I think it'd be really cute if you have the little leg people too. Just stick them on top. I wish I found the turkey that everybody was talking, you know, hauling before. Not everybody. It's kind of rare actually seeing the turkey. I never really saw people um, haul that so much. But when I do, I was like, oh, that's really cute. And I wish I got it. But the one I did see was broken. And it always tends to be the one that's broken that I find let later on. But I didn't get that one. And I, that would have been cute on this bale of hide. And I also picked up the stickers. I'm going to show you them. Just everybody's been hauling these. So these like the blue eye ones. The poofy stickers. I really didn't want to buy all these stickers, so. <laughs> and then these ones, I guess these are different kinds. Didn't realize there's two different kinds. Yeah, the other one has more um, stuff. They're two different styles. But they both got 47 stickers on it. Little skulls. I really like the gold foil around them. Great detail. Oh, it's a glittery over here. And I like these because they're like, the, they call them the glitter stickers from before, like the other holographic ones, but they're not. They're just really shiny. I like that. The little wolf is kind of funny. And then I got the, the little uh, jack-o'-lanterns. So these are funny. I believe I bought all the stickers. I also found, I really wanted to get these buttons. People have been hauling them. I really like it because of this little there, these little buttons. And I really like the ideas of people have been doing for our pocket letters. I would love to watch people's pocket letters, especially the Holly Wayne's ones, if they would just put them up. I would love to look at them and see how they would use these in their pocket letters because they're so cute. But I just buckle. I wish I got these each holiday for, for every holiday. I know they have them for Valentine's Day. And I believe they have them for Easter. I wish I got them because they're so cute. I also picked up the Wiggly Monster Eyes, the Googly Eyes. I actually have them from a long time ago when I was going to Dollar Tree way before hauling. And they have like the eyelashes and like lids, colored lids. They're just so cute. And I never see those anymore. So I have some of those different type of style eyes. And I thought they were really cute. So I got to do something with these. I do plushies a lot. I, do, I, I haven't tried gluing these on to like my little dolls. And maybe I might try these one day. I do buy the real doll eyes where you have to put the clip in the back when I make my plushies. Like um, here's one of them. I, I'm in a room where all my stuff is. Like, here's my little piggy with the little eyes. And I actually use the real doll eyes. And this is just the button. There's quite a few things on my my little table full of my little plushies over there. I also, okay, so I also picked up the cat. I wasn't going to buy the webkins, but I did buy this cat. And the only reason why I bought it is because it's orange. And I'm going to do a DIY of maybe making him a little costume for Halloween. I thought it was really cute because he's he matches the, the colors. Not just the typical black cat. Because I really don't like the black cat stuff because of all the, you know, how it associates with the black bad luck and stuff like that. But because this is orange, that would be adorable. I'll, I might go ahead and make him a little hat. And I'll probably do a DIY on it just because using like some of the Dollar Tree products because I have them at home. So that's it for Halloween. So let's go do the Christmas washi tape. I'm very excited to show you these. Um, how I got these was first off is uh, when I discovered that on Facebook, Java and Gingerbread had showed them. I was very excited. I was like, I just got the wash, the Halloween washi tape and now there's the Christmas ones. And I was like, oh gosh, now I'm on the hunt for that. So I remember going to one of my um, Dollar Trees. It's the one that's really close by to me. It's a brand new store. And I saw the Christmas decorations. I had posted that before, but I didn't like think there was any Christmas washi tape and you know, I was hoping I didn't miss out on it. But on the side, there's like a little strip. Um, I went there again just to check. And lo and behold, I found four of them. So I'm going to go ahead and show it right here. What I found, there was four. And I was like, man, I kind of missed out on those. And I really, really wanted to get them. After seeing what she had there, I thought it was really, really cute. Some of the other ones. So what I did is I, I we have about like 10 or 12 different Dollar Trees around the area in the county. That's just drivable distance. It's not very far um, so, you know, I, I just called around. I would, and the first thing I would ask is because a lot of times they don't really know what washi tape is. They don't know what decorative tape means. They'll tell me it's duct tape and that's not what I'm looking for. So I asked like, do you have your Christmas decorations up? And a lot of them were like, what? They're like, the way it sounded on the phone was like, uh, we're just putting out like Halloween and we just got done doing like our back to school and our harvest is what they call that theme, the autumn stuff. So I was like, okay, well, I was like, do you happen to know when you're going to get that in? And they're like, no. So I was like, okay, I feel stupid. But then at least I asked them, like, do you have any Christmas decorations? And when I say it like that, they're like, no. So there is just one I go to and I actually am, you know, I talk to the manager all the time. And this is why I say that you should have a good rapport with some of the people that you go to the Dollar Trees with so that they can always look out for you whenever you're looking for stuff. So you don't have to go driving around, going crazy, finding things like that. So, um, and he just happens to call every time when I call. So, um, 
and he's like, no, I was like, oh, he, and since he's a manager, of course he knows it's going to be out. And he goes, do you have any Christmas decorations? And I says, no, because I was, I've been saying like, because I need to, I was looking for the decorative tape. Um, and he's like, well, like, because I know there's another Dollar Tree and I told him about the Dollar Tree I go to. Like, everybody has a Christmas decoration stuff. And because he's, I said that, of course, he's going to say like, oh, yeah, I'm going to have to put those up soon. So I'll be doing that next week. So I said, okay, I'm going to be very patient and go over there later because it's not very close to me. Kind of a, a ways away from me but I, I love going to that store because it's the biggest dollar treat that there is so every, i called baby like every day just to make sure when he told me it was going to be thursday it wasn't he said friday it was or whatever so i went there on friday and the manager was there but he was still hasn't had anything on christmas out yet he only had like his uh, shelves kind of taken apart and then when i saw him i go oh what are you doing up here he's like i'm trying to put the christmas stuff up he was really nice I go, oh, okay. It's like, yeah, I won't be done probably till this, this Saturday or something. I was like, oh, okay. Because I'm only looking for one thing, I said to him. He's like, oh, what is it? I'll, I'll get it. I'll, I'll check for you, honey, in the back. That's what he asked. He said to me, I was like, I'm looking for the washi tapes. You know, the decorative tapes. Like, I have a picture of it. So I went back and I showed him my picture. He goes, okay, I'll check. And he goes, hey, and that's the first thing he gives me the box. So I have the box of washi tape. I didn't, he did open it a little bit just to give me an idea. When he showed me the box, I was like, I'm getting the whole thing. I really want the whole thing. And I'm ready doing a swap with other, uh, a swap with another set with somebody else. So if people are asking like, oh, if you have any more and stuff like that, I already have this already in mind for somebody. So I did not open this on purpose because of the fact that I really wanted to go show it on camera. I, I've i been holding off on it and I really want to look at them because I think they're so adorable. So let's go ahead and open this. It's just like a new unboxing for me. I purposely left this in the car so I won't even touch it. So a couple of people have been asking on Instagram, my best friend, Shelby, hey Shelby, um, asking how the box looks like, and since I had it, I was giving her like stuff. I'm hoping that she finds her washi tapes like she said she's going to do today. Um, so I'm really excited for her. And it comes in a pack of two, okay, a pack of 24, but it's just, there's only two sets in there. So letting you know, most Dollar Tree seems like they only get like two that store is a really large volume store and i'm surprised they only got two and look look at all the green washi tapes and i just dropped one of them and it's just the bottom one, so i'm going to take out these i'll just leave one of them in so it comes in a strip and i got the strip <laughs> of course so here we are the stripes the little plaid in red and green oh sorry um the snowman in blue. I kind of like it. They come in different colors. I didn't realize you get multiples of that kind. So I might put these in my giveaway. Some of that in holidays. Chevrons. Wow, we get multiples of those. Whoa. And I heard from before last season or last year they had these in um, some of these are old washi tapes. So since I have multiples of these plaid ones, I guess you can Three. So you really don't get 12 different styles. It really is just probably like nine, I believe. Let's see. No, there's quite a few. The holiday, I got like two of the holidays. So this is what comes in a set. So this is what happens when you don't check right away. But I was just really, really excited about it. So that's why they're like that. I did, well, I don't know why, but I just happened to be looking for more washies. I think I was looking for Christmas just for the heck of it for the people. And I always go down a stationary aisle. And I just went to this one store that I didn't think would have anything, but it's one of those stores, like it's a small store. You guys have to go to your small stores. If you live in a big city like I do, where they have a whole bunch of Dollar Trees, you gotta go to the smaller ones where a lot of people don't even know what tape is like so, because um, when I was buying the strip I found or buy a couple, they're like, what is that? They were like, the customers don't even know what those are. I found the new washi tape and I bought a strip and I'm so excited because I thought these were old at first because they do kind of look like some of the old stuff. You can see it on their dollartree.com. Like some of, if you look up deco tapes and um, you'll see some of their little, um, you know, little designs and it looks like it's been there for a while, but then I found some other ones. So I got these. Like this kind of looks kind of old to me. I've never seen the postage one. This might be new. But I'm fairly new to all this washi tape stuff, so that's why. And then there's the owls that everybody loves. And then the pink cheetah. And the star one, I'm going to show you. This is very familiar to me because Daiso has the same one. I had to get my Daiso one up. It's the same one. Let me see, sorry. Even the same print on there. The only difference is this, the only difference between this one and that one, which I will take out and I'll give you. 
let me just go ahead and keep showing you this first before I do. So there's the little banners that looks new. And I'm so happy I found that. I found out later on in another dollar store that this also has, if you can see it, I'll take that one out for you, but I'm just gonna keep going till I get to the end. So the star one, and this is the one that comes from the Dollar Tree, right? Let me see if I'm getting too close up, sorry. The Dollar Tree and this one. The only difference is the Dollar Tree version, and I don't know if you can tell right here, it has a little bit of sparkly glitter on it. And the one from Daiso does not. So for all you people who have Daiso and are looking, who always sees these, you'll notice that this one, this is the Daiso one, and it's just a regular yellow. I'm sorry, there. Regular yellow, sorry for the glare. And this one, the other one has some glitter on it. So um, if that matters to you at all, and you collect washi tape like I do, <laughs> then there is a difference, even though they look the same, they're not. So on this one, I guess you can't really see it unless I open it. And I'll just go ahead and open it because those are cute anyway. I don't know if you could see them, but there's these are the designs on it. And I believe there was an owl on one part, but I can't see it now because it just kind of folds over. And this is pretty good tape because it's not very thin. So I kind of like that per se. I do apologize, my hands look horrible. That's why I tend to not do my hauls because my hands are so bad. But um But yeah, I think there's an owl on this one. There's a snail and such as so I thought those were so cute. So that's it. Those are the ones of the new washi tapes. And they still had, at that one store, they also have the lace ones with the glitter. So I just picked up the regular glitter blue one. I believe I had this one already. But I just, when I found I just went and got some because it's always nice to have just the plain one because you always use them. Um, oh, yeah. And one other thing. I'm sorry. I just picked up some more of these uh, envelopes. Okay. I'm back again. And this is an addendum to my um, Dollar Tree that I just put together right now. Um, the only reason why I'm doing this is because after that whole uh, washi tape fiasco when I opened up my Christmas on washi tape and notice that a lot of them was missing. I got to talking to, to some of my subscribers. Uh, one of them was uh, Shelby. Hey girl. And we were chit chatting over Instagram and she had gotten her box the next day after I showed her like the skew and stuff. And she, her box had all of them, all of every single one of them, at least uh, one or twice. Cause she got a two, she got a box of 24. And I was like, man, that's not fair. How come I was like, I got all these other ones that are multiples of, and I didn't want any of those. So um, what I did is I did call around that same moment and I was able to, you know, find two locations that actually were just getting the box and haven't even opened them. And it's funny because today I also went to the Dollar Tree and it's now, it's Saturday, and I just keep seeing the, the Christmas washi tapes and Halloween washi tapes everywhere. They're just like sitting around and stuff. So I, you know, I keep finding them anywhere anyway. But um, the other ones were yesterday I found two places that had the boxes unopened. So I was able just to choose what I wanted and not have to worry about that. So anyway, um, I wanted to go ahead and show you those. And of course, as I was there doing that, I found more stuff. So this is a little bit, a bit of a longer haul again, because I'm adding more stuff to it. So these are the last three that I didn't get. And what I'll do is um, now that I have the whole complete set, I'll just go ahead and post the picture right up here. And you can just see it for yourselves. But this is the one I got, you can see that. So that's how it looks like. And this one. This is really, really, really cute. And the trees. I believe those are the ones I was missing. So those are the ones I got. I also picked up this. I follow these. Actually, I thought these are just so cute. I didn't help not get them. These are the sticker boxes. I really like the owls. So it looks like you get the little owls in this little box. As you can see, the stickers that you will get. Oh, they're cute. So might stick these in like you know um trick-or-treat or trick-or-treaters trick and stuff like that but really maybe just like get the stickers are so cute and i also picked up the small one you know i collect these little storage bins and this was that moment when i don't have this color so i'm really excited to get that one um i also picked up more uh duct tape that i haven't picked up for some reason i never did i just finally i guess finally found the chevron people have been sending me friend mails with this duct tape and pretty duct tape you can always use it for something so I, I picked this one up and I also pick up the camera one I don't know I've seen the camera one there before I never really picked it up this is the last one at that store and so I might as well go ahead and get these I don't know I think camel is pretty cool and the Halloween section I finally found the scarves you know I haven't seen the scarves everybody been hauling the scarves I'm just so happy I got to find them so I just picked up two I did not get the other one that was kind of orange it says happy Halloween and had all the jack lanterns on it I didn't get that one I just got these two so I thought that was kind of cool. 
just in case like somebody didn't get to wear their costume and they can go use these, but I think these are pretty. I try to get a festive one each each holiday and then after that next year I'm probably not going to be getting more scarves because I have way too many scarves. I also picked up these in the automotive section along with the um, duct tape. That's where everything is usually. As these universal stereo cassette adapters, I know like if you have an older car and you have a tape adapter, you can't listen to your phone, your iPhone, or whatever, and you can just use an auxiliary cord. So I picked up three, uh, two of these. They had them in black, red, and blue. Um, let me know if any of you guys have tried these before. I always have a bad luck with them, and I bought like some in the past. And because it's a dollar, it's not really a bad deal just to try it out. I just want to be able to hear my phone sometimes. So um, um, if you have an older cars, and I'll give this to my mom too if she needs it first. I was glad I found those. I've never really seen those at the Dollar Tree. I also picked up um, these home run bandages that are the diamond backs. Yeah, I've never seen this before because where I'm from, it's you know the Padres. So I got the diamond backs. It was this is from Arizona. It's, it says so. I've never even you know me. I don't even like. I'm not even a sports player, but you know I'm trying to collect bandages. So I don't know why we have an Arizona uh, bandage set here. So. I got those for part of my collection and to also use. I also, for some of the craft stuff I picked up was this, just the twine, these uh, Baker's twine. I just thought because they had them all there, they had all the colors. I feel I'd like to use this for a certain project or DIY I might have in store, but I just like them because all the colors were available. And sometimes they don't usually have all the colors, so I just wanted to make sure I got them so I have use for them when I do. Not, not as if my craft section doesn't need enough stuff as it is, but I have a lot of things. Um, I was actually looking for the one, the, the glitter with the black in it. I use the small little containers from the Dollar Tree after I'm done with each of these glitters because it's very messy. But I got these and um, I was hoping I could find the black silver ones. I gotta see, I might have those already, but I thought because these are the fall colors, you can be useful. I'm gonna be doing a, D a DIY with that cat from the Webkin's cat. So I might just use this. I'm hoping I could find black, but because of that, as I was looking for the Webkins, um, I found more Webkins. I just didn't find the, sh the lamb that I wanted, but somebody is already sending that to me. So thank you very much, Shalia Luna. Um, number 505, I think is your number, but uh, Shalia Luna is what I remember. And she's sending me the little lamb. I'm so happy about that. But I found more of the little Webkins dogs. I didn't like the poodle or the little white Yorkie or Westie, I guess. So I got these and stuff because this one reminds me of my beagle. And I got the little spaniel looking one, so I picked these two up. I thought those are so cute. I don't know if they have a tag names or anything on it. I doubt they do. This is the Cocker Spaniel, and this is a Golden Retriever. So this is a Cocker Spaniel. I don't know. It looks more like a beagle, even though the colors are not the same. But if I do find the beagle one, I'll be very, very, very excited about that. So I got that to go with my cats. <laughs> and I also found the styluses. Um, Think Big Days. Think Big Days and Ivy Val had posted it up on their Instagram, and I was like, <gasps> I really want to get one of the stylus because I'm a stylus collector. I'm weird like that. So I found them finally and they're really, really cute. They're like little jumbo sticks. So I got this one with the little paisley flowers and stuff. I thought that was really, really cute. And of course these are not, you know, real erasers. I also picked up this one. There's only four styles, so I got them all. This weird green psychedelic. It looks like an eye. Like a target, but bullseye looking, but eyes it looks kind of odd and the last one is the blue and black stripe one so i got these three these four these are so cute though and then i found this these are the glamour lines ultimate bra strap solution you know i i bought some of these before from walmart i'm just really mad that i found them at walmart and they're like six or seven dollars and to find this for a dollar i knew they could be found for a dollar i don't know why i couldn't find them so i'm not sure if this has been in the dollar tree for a very long time I don't know, but I finally saw them decide to keep them because you always lose these anyway. They're just like, to me, they're like oversized giant plastic paper clips that you could just use for your your bra. So it's like, man, people are making a dime a dozen on these things when they, you know, when you can find a Dollar Tree. So I got that. I was happy about that part. And then I finally found the satin pillowcases. I really wanted to get them. I found one at one store, and then when I saw one today, I said, I might as well get two just to match. Um, my bedroom decor is turning red, as you can see, this is my shower curtain, so I'm trying to get things to turn red slowly but surely, and hopefully this will kind of go with the rest of the thing. And everybody says it's nice because it's good to sleep on this, so I've been hearing good things about sleeping on satin pillows, and since they're only a dollar, I might as well, right? Okay, so last thing, 
is on to the makeups that I found. People have been hauling these. But first off, I actually found these nails. I'm not sure if I sent this to you, Mama V. I know I was sending you a package, but I can't remember if I saw this. I finally watched one of your videos and you said you were looking for this one. So if I did not send it to you in your box, let me know. This one's already for you. Or even regardless, if I sent you one, I could send you another set if you really, really like these. So these are just sitting around. First off, I found these e.l.f. HD blushes. I know this one is called Encore and this one is called Superstar, which is two different shades of colors on it. These are only two I found. I just want to make sure it's not really too old. So let's see. Oh, they're pumps. So they're like little pumps. And you know, I did see Rebecca, I can't remember, Clark, I believe. So Rebecca Clark had um, swatched these. So. She said they're really, really pigmented and it's really bright colored, but I just picked these up. Um, I might just give these out as a, um, in my giveaway. The other e.l.f. Uh, product I found was the eye Jumbo Eyeshadow Stick and this is Turkish Coffee and it's creamy, pigment, rich eye color. So I got that as well. I also found the Profusion Palettes. They are the Glitter Raz Journal in Leopard. Uh, set and I found this blue one and what I'll do is because I can't open these I, I for real I went when I went when I went to uh, pay for this I had a cashier open it for me so she, I could see how they look like but for the life of me I cannot open these because I'm afraid I'm gonna hurt myself I got the blue one I got the pink one and I thought these are so adorable and the silver one okay and I'm not going to be also keeping these myself I don't really keep use too much makeup so I'm gonna actually give this in my giveaway okay and before I start with the power lip Milani's that I found I did not find the chunky ones everybody has been hauling I've been seeing on Instagram and on Facebook everyone keeps hauling the Milani products and I haven't seen those really chunky thick looking lippies so I only I'll show you what I have but I found this one which is I just nearly have a color but I just got this light pinky color and I guess this is more the darker color. This is darker and this is the lighter color. So it's the light pink and this is kind of like more like a, somewhat like a coral. It looks like it's more orange in, in the video, but it really isn't that color at all. So I got those too. Now, as for the mil the power lips, I did find all the colors. I hope that it's all the colors because I got all seven. And the reason why I know this is because there's like a number on the side. So let's start with number one. Number one is called Red Control. and then number two is called Cabernet or Cabaret blend Cabaret blend looks like a kind of like a dark maroonish color and then number three is raspberry tart More like a pinkish kind of purple color so that's pretty number four is pink lemonade this looks kind of red but I got another color that's more red than that. And then number five is Macaroon. Number six is Strawberry Sugar. And the last one is Mango Tango. So that's it. That's all I found. I found all those Milani uh, products and that's all I have for this addendum, I know this is a very long video because I'm actually adding on to the other ones. So um, I hope you liked it anyway and found things that you liked. Please like, share, subscribe, and comment. And I'll see you in my next video. I'm doing a Daiso right after this. So um, keep on the lookout for that. Okay, bye.